Okay, I've got the same project open here from the last couple lessons and we're going to go ahead and look at how we can launch our website at the end of the installation process instead of serving a thank you screen. So let's go ahead first and remove our screen. So we'll go to the after installing event in the screens area. Let's go ahead and remove this finished install screen by clicking on the remove button and pressing OK. Now there's nothing to uh, show the user uh, that the installation process has been finished. Okay, It's just going to go ahead and finish and that's going to be that. Let's go ahead now into the actions area and the on post install event and we'll go ahead and substitute our website launching for that screen. So let's click the add action button and then let's choose from the choose a category list the file category and we'll choose the action file open URL. We'll go ahead and press next and then we're just going to go ahead and substitute our website for the website that's typed in here. Okay, you've got a couple different options for the window screen. Let's go ahead and choose one just for the heck of it. How about maximize? And we'll go ahead and press finish. Then we'll go ahead and press OK and build our application. Okay, there we go. We can go into our setups folder and go ahead and run our setup. Now as you can see here, it's uh, it's still missing those beginning screens. It doesn't ask our name or anything anymore because we removed those in the last lesson. It goes through the installation process and there we go. It gives us our website at the end instead of the finish screen. Now, if you're going to be informing people, uh, for example, that the installation process has been finished, you might want to direct them to a website page which specifically says thank you for installing. Uh, for example, would you like to download these extras or would you like to register with our users area? Or for example, it could take them to the support forum or the support site. There's, a, there's myriad ideas where you could apply this particular technique. But at any rate, that's the easy way to send somebody to your website at the end of your installation. Just using the file URL, file open URL action uh, set to your website.